Okay, hello, I'm Chris, and in this video, this is going to be a real quick video, but I'm just going to be showing you, um, in case you're going through an old car, this is a 70 Chevelle, this is the wiring I'm going through right now, and you have questionable uh, plugs, we're going to dip them in there, I'm going to dip a bunch of different types, uh, common types, uh, the 194 connectors, pigtail whatever that is these are the 1156 and 7 the tail lights and then I'm gonna dip this whole um, a license plate light thing in there and uh, different things and then we're gonna take them out and we're gonna see what happens um, I know these will come back to brand new but let's see what happens to the rest of them well alright well I'm about to take them out and show you the results uh, I'm not gonna lie I accidentally left them in there for probably two days I've left them in there before for 24 hours, so I guess we'll see if it causes any harm. It should not cause any harm, but let's take a look at them. I think the main thing you need to know when you're cleaning parts in this, electrical parts, is you need to have you a good air compressor, and you're going to have to wash these parts off real good. That's why we didn't just uh, put the whole harness in there, because we're going to have to completely wash these off and then blow them out completely. I mean, I think it looks a lot better. Anyway, I'm gonna go wash these off and we'll blow them off and take a look at them. All right, so I got everything cleaned off. We're gonna go ahead and take a look at some of the parts. How they came out. See, this is the, uh, I put one of these in there, this license plate light. Cleaned everything out real good. What was kind of interesting was it cleaned that lens too. So now I don't have don't have to buy a new one. I use this one. All right, so that looks good now. The piece of ascending unit looks good. This is for the emergency brake pedal. Clean that off real nice. It looks brand new ish. Of course, that's your regular normal terminal. Made it look brand new. This is a cigarette lighter made it look brand new after blowing off these 194 bulb connectors they look very good very nice clean now the plug looks brand new looks real nice can't really see it look good now these came out real nice. I'm going to do a side by side. They look real good. That's the reverse lights. So yeah, it cleans them up real nice. Okay, so I don't know everything about dielectric grease, but all I know is, is, is you use it on these connectors and uh, you just read what it does, but it, it protects them. That's the main thing from corrosion. Just wanna go ahead and use it. All these from the factory had the grease on them. Okay, we got the two clean tail lights. Okay, all I have is 1157s right now. Just, oh, what the fudge. Oh, okay. Man, you can do this however you want, man. Of course, I'm gonna use this for two bulbs, but just put it all over the damn thing. It ain't gonna hurt it. Okay. Okay, I thought I had more bulbs. We're just gonna do one. So basically just put it all in there. You just want it to look like that in case you have no idea. In case you have no idea, just rub it all over the bulb. You just want it to look messy like that. That's about it. 
That stuff works real good. Thanks for watching.